Hey guys, what's going on? This is Marcel from One Dapper Street. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my studio slash closet slash office. And welcome to another episode of my Getting Dressed series where I look at how I put outfits together step by step. And hopefully you guys take a little something away. Today we're going to look at a color. Well, not a color, all the colors. Uh, technically a contrast. We're looking at white. White is a white look. White pieces can be really hard to pull off sometimes, but I want to show you a look today that I put together that I really like and hopefully you guys do too. And just a couple of thoughts about why I put it together. So let's take a look. Starting off with this Peteri jacket in all white. You've got contrast zippers, you've got some light padding. It's a perfect jacket for the spring because it's got a little bit of room so if you want to layer something underneath you absolutely can, but if you just want to wear a t-shirt and wear it unzipped it's going to work great until the warmer days of spring. It's definitely a sporty jacket with the hood and just overall the fit. Not something I wear all the time, so it was a bit of a challenge for me, but you can even see the padding on the back. I think it's a beautifully designed jacket, and where I started with was with these uh, Topman jeans that I bought a while ago in Australia. The detail on the side with the tab is really nice. They're also nice and fitted, but just a bit roomy. So like, I would call these a slim fit, probably. Others might call them a skinny fit. For me, that's slim. And then I broke the two white pieces apart but kept it bright with this turtleneck from Joseph Aboud. It's a beautiful piece. In New York it's still a bit chilly so this look absolutely worked for um, when I wore it. I think with an all white look, if you don't want to go all white, all white, it's best to keep the colors bright and somewhat, um, somewhat complimentary. So here I wore grey suede Chelsea boots by Aquatalia, which I believe are a favorite of yours. Many, many people commented on those in the past. So you see there, it's similar, um, it's a similar color to the turtleneck, but not exactly the same, and I think that's alright. Keeping it light with silver accessories, <laughs> silver accessories, my Ray-Ban shades that have an ombre from gold to silver, and my silver Piaget watch. I thought they worked really nicely with the look, because the silver kind of goes nicely with the white, while the gold picks up a little bit on the hue of the sweater, and that's already the look, so... I kept it very simple. I think it's important with an all white or mostly white look because it can be already a lot just having all that much white. So what I usually do is I don't go all white but I keep it bright and throw another couple of colors in there just to make it a little bit more muted and a little bit more wearable. And if you guys want to take a look at what this looks like in motion, not just me standing in front of the camera, you can do so in three, two, one. <laughs> look in motion so I'm gonna go this summer and definitely explore the whole white topic more with different videos and different outfits because I think like I said it can it can definitely be a challenge to pull this off and I want to try and make sure to help you guys as best I can if you got any questions regarding the color white or any like more specific please let me know down below in the comments if you like the video give it a thumbs up and if you want to subscribe to my channel to not miss out on any of the videos that are coming up make sure to hit that subscribe button turn on post notifications so you know exactly when the new video is coming up and with that I pretty much want to sum it up for today thank you guys so much for watching I'll see you soon stay dapper <laughs>